afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the Brainy Boomer Lecture Series. We're so very happy you've all joined us today. So in 2007, the McGill University Research Center for Studies in Aging, or the MCSA's Education Committee, started the Brainy Boomer Lecture Series in order to suggest practical steps to both improve and maintain brain health, as well as to promote healthy lifestyle choices amongst the most populous generation in history. The MCSA Education Committee, which was founded in 1996, has three main objectives. Identifying education needs of healthcare providers, seniors, caregivers, and the public, and to develop responses to meet some of those needs. To enhance the image of the aging process by addressing stereotypes and myths about aging. And finally, the dissemination of research on aging. Today, our guest speaker is part owner of GSC Athletics, which is a fitness studio located in La Salle for people of all ages. Juliana Guerrero has been in the personal fitness industry for eight years and has extensive experience in developing and building training programs for all fitness levels and for people of all ages. Through her experience working in the personal fitness industry, Juliana has applied her vast knowledge of fitness to creating her own fitness programs. Before continuing, please note that you are joining this online session at your own risk and that MCSA takes no responsibility for anyone being injured or having too much fun. By entering this website and taking part in the activities, you accept all the risks that may be associated with it. If you do not agree with this disclaimer, please stop now and don't take part in this Zoom activity. Veuillez noter que vous rejoignez cette session en ligne à vos risques et périls, et que CMEV décline toute responsabilité en cas de blessure ou d'une surplus de plaisir. En accédant à ce site et en participant aux activités, vous acceptez les risques qui pourront être associés. Si vous n'êtes pas d'accord avec cet avertissement, arrêtez et ne participez pas à cette session de Zoom. Before moving forward, we would just like to remind you to please mute your microphone on Zoom, and if you have any questions at all, just put them down in the chat box or you could ask them at the end of the class. And now for the moment we're all waiting for, I present Juliana Guerrero with Upper Body Movement. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, all right, we're going to get started. Upper Body Movement today, focusing on that upper body, a bit of that core, but stretching in between. All right, so we're going to warm up like we always do. Just get those muscles warmed up, that blood flowing. All right, let's get started. All right, so we're gonna just start with our walking march. So you're gonna just bring those knees up. You're gonna move those hands with you. You're going all at your own pace, whatever your body can handle. All right, if you wanna go a little faster, you can go a little faster. If not, just hold it here. Go left to right. You can bring those knees a little higher if you'd like. If not, just keep them right here. All right, keep it going, everybody. We got five, four, three, two, one, and time. All right, we're gonna step touch. So you're gonna come forward, back, right, and back. Bring that leg forward, back, forward, back, all right? You can bring those arms out, swing them in, out, swing them in. There you go. Good. Slow movements, just stretching out that upper body. Good. Reach. There you go. Good work. Breathe. Good. Out and in. Out and in. There you go. 10 seconds here. Good work. For five, four, three, two, one, and time. Go work. All right, we're going to go for our step touch. So you're going to go left side, step touch, and then right side. All right, so we've done these before. So you're gonna just step touch left to right. All right, ready? Let's go. You can get those arms moving with you. Up and down, step touch, step touch. All at your own pace. There you go, good. Good, keep it going. There you go. 15 seconds here, just warming up that body. For 10, you got it. Good. Five, four, three, two, one, 
and time. Go work. All right. We're going to roll those hands. You're going to roll those hands. You're going to roll those arms. You're going to lengthen those arms. Come down. Roll them. Big rolls. And then back. Feel that stretch. Keep a little bend in those knees. Back straight at all times. Come forward. Bring it back. Roll it out. Whew. And again. Roll. Good. One last time. Forward. Big rolls. There you go. Good work. All right. Now, this time we're going to go back and bring it forward. Roll it out. There you go. Again. Good. Three more. Roll forward. Keep that core tight. Again. There you go. One more. And time. Go work. All right. We're going to punch to the side. So you're going to take your right hand. You're going to punch and then bring it in. As you punch out, extend that right leg out and bring it in. Punch. Bring it in. All right. We're going to start with that right side first. A little bend in that left leg. Let's go. Punch. And in. Punch. And in. There you go. And bring it in. Good. Control. And in. Five. Four. Three. There you go. Two. One. And time. Good work. All right. Same concept. Other side. We're going to punch. Bring that left leg out now. And then bring it in. So just rotate that upper body just a bit and then rotate it back into the center. Let's go. One, and in. Two, and in. There you go. Three, let's go. Four, five, six, there you go. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good work. All right, last one, then we grab some water. We're gonna just skip it out, just slow and steady. All right, get those arms moving, tap, tap. All right, just walk it out. And if you want, you can get that little hop. If not, just walk it out. There you go. Good, all at your own pace. You can go a little slower, just like this. Or you can go a little faster and add that hop. Whatever your body hand can handle. Let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Go work. All right. Just bring those hands up, lengthen that upper body, reach for the sky. Hold it here just for a second. Take a deep breath in and then a deep breath out and lengthen those arms. Again, one more time. Bring it up and let it go. All right, grab some water. We're going to get started. All right, we're all good. All warmed up, a little warm. All righty. All right, so if you have dumbbells, great. If not, we'll do it with your own body weight. All right, so our focus is on our upper body and core today. So if you have your dumbbells, grab them. If not, don't worry about it. You can do it with your own body weight, all right? So basically, we're gonna go for simple exercises. We're gonna go for bicep curls first. So you're gonna give a little bend in those knees to cure that lower body. Back straight, chest proud. You're gonna come down and full extension on those curls. You're coming up, curl, and then bring it back down. Come up, squeeze those two arms together, and then slowly bring it back down. All right, let's go. Up and down. Good, come up and down. There you go, let's go. Three and down. 
four. Good. Keep those elbows right to your side. Four, five. And down. Six. Good, keep it going. Seven. Slow movements on your way down. Eight, fast movements on your way up. There you go, let's go for nine. And down. Last one, 10. All right, slow movements on your way down. Hold it halfway. Hold for five, four, three, two, one, and time release. Good. All right, roll out those shoulders. Breathe in, breathe out. All right, everybody. We're gonna hold our dumbbells, right? Just like this, all right? What we're doing, you're gonna give a little bend in the knee. We're gonna go up and bring it down, alternating sides, all right? So you're just gonna pivot on that foot just a little bit as you bring that four upward punch, and then you're gonna bring it back down to that chest. You're gonna pivot and then bring it back down, keeping that core tight, back straight, chest proud. All right, let's go. One, and down. Two, and down. Three, good. Four, five, there you go. Six, and down. Seven, good, you got it. Eight, there you go. Nine, 10, keep it going. Up and down, up and down. There you go. Keep it for one, down. Two, down, three, down. Last one, four, and down. Good work, all right, release those hands. Just release those hands, straighten out that body. We're gonna just one shoulder roll on our right side for two, three, and four. Other side, same thing. One, two, three, and four. Good work. All right. We're going to come up in that lateral raise. So you're going to bring those dumbbells to your eyes and then bring it back down. All right. I want your arms straight as possible. You're coming up to your eye level and then slowly bring it down. Always remember, keep that back straight. All right. Let's go a little bend in those knees to secure that lower body. Come up and down. Up and down. Good work. Keep that core tight. Three. And down. Four. And down. There you go. Five. And down. Six. And down. Seven. You got it. Eight. And down. Nine, and down. Last one, and bring it down. All right, we're gonna bring it back up and you're gonna hold it for me for five seconds. For five, four, three, two, one, and release, good work. All right, just drop those weights right in front. We're gonna bring up those hands. So you're gonna bring up those hands. Lengthen that upper body. Turn those palms facing the ceiling and reach for the sky. Hold it right here. Lengthening that whole body. You're gonna slowly bring those arms down, slow and steady, and just hold it right here and feel that stretch on your chest for three, two, one. We're gonna release those hands. And we're gonna just give me two big rolls. One and two. All right, last one, then we'll grab some water. We're gonna focus a bit on the core this time. So 
You're gonna lengthen that, those arms. You're gonna bring your knee in. So, a little bend in those legs. You're gonna bring it in and up. All right, standing crunch. Crunch that core, bring it back up. You're gonna crunch and bring it back up. All right, we're gonna start with the right side first. Let's go. Crunch and bring it up. Crunch and up, good. Three, there you go. Four, good. Five, six, there you go. Seven, eight, nine, and last one, and time, good work, all right. Bring those arms down. We're gonna go with the left side now. Same thing, we're gonna bring those hands up. You're gonna crunch it in and bring it up. Now, if it's too difficult to bring that knee up with you, just bring it forward, crunch, and bring it back up. Crunch, and bring it back up, all right? Let's go. One, crunch, and up. Two, and up. Three, there you go. Four, up. Five, up. Six, there you go. Seven, good. Eight, nine, last one, and 10. Go work, all right. Bring those arms down. Two deep breaths. And again. All right, grab some water. Woo. Good work. We're all good, thumbs up. Good, perfect. All right, Whew. a little sweaty. All right, so next exercise, next circuit. We're gonna go for some shoulder press. We've done these in the past. So basically, you're gonna keep your arms 90 degrees in that angle, your back stays straight at all times, and that chest proud. You're gonna hold it right here. We're gonna alternate arms. So we're gonna bring that left arm up first, bring it down, and then that right arm goes up, and you're gonna bring it down. And you're gonna go back to that left, bring it down, and then back to that right, and bring it down. All right, so we're gonna get started. Position yourself well. Remember, keep that back straight, a little bend in those knees to secure that lower body. Come up, let's get started. So we're gonna go left and down, go right, and down, there you go. And down, and down, perfect. Alternating arms, there you go. Keeping that core tight as well, let's go. Keep that rhythm going, and right, good. And left, and right, there you go. We got five more, for five, down, four, down, three, down, two, down, and one, down. Good work. All right, lengthen those arms. Just give me two shoulder rolls. One, two. All right, we're gonna reset that body. We're going back in that same position. This time, you're gonna close it in, and you're gonna bring it out. You're gonna close it in and bring it out. All right, so it should look like this. You're gonna close it in and bring it out. All right, we're good. Let's get started. Back straight, a little bend in those knees. Position yourself like before. Let's close it in and bring it out. There you go, great work. Close it in, bring it out. That's two, close it in. Bring it out, three, four, 
There you go. Five. Six. Good. Seven. Eight. Last two. Nine. And ten. Good work. Woo. If you felt a little bit of a burning sensation, that's your muscles working. It's all normal. All right. We're going to stay in this position. Just bring your arms down. Give me two shoulder rolls in back. One. And two. All right. And you're going to give me two forward ones. You're going to come around. One. And two. Good. All right. Whew. Okay. This time we're going to come up. So your hands are going to be right in front of you. You're going to come up, bend those elbows to your chest, and then you're going to bring it back down into that middle. You're going to come up to that chest and bring it back down in the middle. All right. Back straight, chest proud. Lengthen those arms. Let's go for one and down two and down there you go three and down four good and down five and down six and down there you go keep it going we got seven and down eight down nine down last one ten and down go work all right just roll out those shoulders and back this is our little break in between our sets all right we're going to take a deep breath in and a deep breath out one more time and out all right we're going to focus on the core this time you're going to hold the dumbbells right to your side all right a little bend in those knees we're going to reach to that left side get as low as you possibly can trying to tap that knee and you're going to bring it up back to that center and we're going to rotate to that right reach for that knee and then up into that center keeping that core tight all right let's go left reach and bring it up secure that body make sure that back straight come down to the right hand side reach and up there you go left hand side now and up you got it keep it going and up there you go let's go left up right up good up right side up last two on each side one up two up go work all right let's drop those weights to our side we're going to just go for a little movement, a little body movement with that upper body. You're going to release that left leg and punch it forward. And you're going to bring it in and squeeze. So you're going to intensity, punch it forward, and then bring it in. All right. And then we'll grab some water. Ready? Let's go. Punch it forward and squeeze it in. There you go. Let's go. Forward and in good forward in that's three forward squeeze it in four five six there you go seven eight nine last one and 10, go work. 
other side. Same thing, I want intensity on that punch and intensity on that squeezing it in. All right, ready? Let's go, bring it out and in. There you go. One, that's two, three, there you go, good work. Four, five, you got it. Six, seven, eight, two more. Nine, last one, and 10. Woo, great work, all right. Bring those hands up, reach. And then as you bring those arms down, exhale on that breath. Bring it in. And bring it out. Last one. Bring it up. And bring it down. Great work. All right, let's grab some water. Woo! How are we all feeling? We're good? Thumbs up, which means it's good. All right, grab a sip of water. Let's reset our body. What time is it? Oh, perfect. You've got time. All right. So next one. You're gonna grab those weights if you have them. If not, just go with your own body movement. Your own body, you're doing the same movements like us, just without the dumbbells, all right? If you don't have them. We're gonna get started. You're gonna just give a bend into your knee, like every other exercise. Instead of going front raises like we did before, we're gonna go lateral. So you're gonna come up to the side and you're gonna bring it back down into the middle. You're gonna come up and bring it down into the middle, all right? So I just want a little bend in those elbows Chest proud, back straight. You're gonna come up and down. All right, let's get started right away. Let's go. You're gonna come up and slowly bring it down. Two and down. Three and down, good. Four, and down, there you go. Five, and down. Six, and down. Seven, and down. Eight, and down. Nine, and down, last one. 10, and down, go work. All right, this time, you're gonna just lengthen that body, keep a little bend in those knees. We did, we did bicep curls our first exercise. This time, we're gonna go for our hammer curls. So, your palms are inwards, you're gonna bring it up and down. All right, so I want, it, I want you to keep your palms just like this. You're coming up, squeeze, and bring it back down. All right, keep those elbows to the side. Right away, position yourself well. Let's go, we're targeting every muscle in that upper body today. We're going up and down. Come up, squeeze, and bring it down slowly. Up, good. That's three, four, good, five, six, there you go, seven, good, eight, good, last two, one, last one, and 10. All right, you're gonna bring it down halfway and just hold it for me for five, four, three, two, one, and release. Good work. All right, 
We're gonna drop the weights for now. Just put them right in front. We're gonna need them again soon. All right, we're gonna go a little bend in those knees. We're gonna just take a deep breath in. So your hands right at your chest. We're gonna come down and up. Breathe in, let's go again. Breathe it in and breathe it out. One last time. Bring it to your chest, breathe in and breathe out. All right, great work. All right, so we're gonna pick up those weights again. We're gonna go for some punches. All right. So you're gonna just position yourself a little. So you're gonna position your left leg forward just a bit and then you're gonna bring that right leg in back just a bit. Give a little nice bend to those knees. Secure the forward punches, left, and you're gonna bring it into that chest. Then you're gonna go right and you're gonna bring it in. Go left, bring it in, right, bring it in. All right, let's get started. Secure those knees right away. Let's go forward, in, right, in, left. There you go, keep it going. And in, good. If you want, you can go a little faster. In, if not, just a little slower. There you go, all at your own pace. Good, there you go, we got 10 seconds here. And in, go work for five, four, three, two, one, and time. Good work, good work, all right. I'm gonna stay here in this position, right in the middle. All right, you're gonna bring those weights to your shoulders and you're gonna just hold it right here. All right, we're gonna turn to our left hand side, bring it up and then turn to our right hand side and bring it up. All right, keep that core tight, a little different than our movements like this last time. You're keeping your weights right at your shoulders. Secure that upper body. You're gonna just twist left, hold it here, and bring it up. And then you're gonna twist right, hold it, and bring it up, all right? Keeping that core tight with every movement. Let's go, left, up, right, up. There you go. Keep it going, everybody, let's go. Up. Up, there you go. Good. You got it. And up. Up, there you go for five. Up, four, up, three. Good. Two, up, one, up, and time. Good work, all right. We're gonna just roll, shoulder, roll, I can't speak today. Roll those shoulders back, bring them back <laughs> for one, two, and three. All right, we're gonna bring it forward. Let's go one, two, last one. All right, great work. All right, we're gonna keep our dumbbells. One last exercise and then we're gonna grab some water. All right, so you're gonna keep the dumbbells together, just like this, all right? You're gonna hold them here. You're gonna give a little bend to those elbows and you're gonna bring it up to your chest and you're gonna bring it back down slowly. You're gonna bring it up to your chest and bring it back down slowly. All righty, we're good, let's go. A little bend in those knees. Chest proud, bring it up, keep that core tight, and bring it down. There you go. Up and down. Bring it up and down.
down. This is working the shoulder muscles and that core. Bring it up and down. There you go. Up and down. Up and down. We got five more. Five and down. Four. Down. Three. Down. Two. Down. Last one. One. And down. Go work. All right, let's drop those weights right in the middle. All right, we're going to take those hands together. You're going to face the palms outwards. And you're going to just reach and lengthen those arms. Hold it here for five, four, three, two, one. We're going to bring it up. We're reach for that sky for five, four, three, two, one. And you're going to slowly release. Three, two, one. All right, let's grab some water. We're all good, a little sore. Great work, keep it up everybody. You're all doing great. All right, perfect timing. All right, so we're gonna start back with our dumbbells. All right, we're gonna go for some arm kickbacks. So what that is. All right, so you're going, so you're gonna position, I'm gonna show you your positioning first. You're gonna just legs width apart, a little bend in those knees, and you're gonna just bring that upper body a little forward. All right, hands at your hips. So what you're doing is you're gonna bring it up in a curl, and then you're gonna bring it back and squeeze keeping those arms as straight up as possible. Then you're gonna bring it up in that curl and you're gonna bring it back and squeeze. All right, ready? We've done these in the past. All right, let's get started. So like I said, a little bend in those knees, bring that upper body a little forward. We're gonna come into that curl and then you're gonna extend and squeeze and then bring it back into that curl and out into that lengthening position. Bring it up in that curl and lengthen those arms and squeeze. There you go. Up and squeeze. Good. Up and squeeze. Good, you got it, keep it going. For five, good. Three. There you go. Two. Last one. And time. Great work. All right. We're going to focus on some core. If you want to challenge yourself a bit, you can keep the dumbbells with you. If not, let them go if it gets too heavy. I'm going to show you the exercise and then you decide. You're going to bring that one arm up and you're going to just bring it in and bring that elbow to your knee, that elbow to your hip, and then bring it back up, and you're gonna bring that elbow to your hip, all right? So you're gonna just go for a side crunch. If you want, you can keep the weights. If not, let them go, do it with your own body weight, all right? Let's get started with the right hand side first. So you're gonna position yourself, keep this left arm down, right arm comes up. So you're gonna come up, and then crunch. Good, come up and crunch. There you go. I want slow movements, nothing fast and crunch. Keeping that core tight. There you go, keep it going everybody for four. Good, up, five, there you go, six, Good. Seven. Good. Eight. There you go. Nine. 
last one and 10 good work all right that was an upper body core movement same thing now other side we're going to bring that arm up hold that left hand lengthen you're going to come down squeeze and bring it back up you're going to come down squeeze and bring it back up all right let's go two there you go three good four good five there you go six good seven there you go eight nine last one and ten good work all right we're gonna drop those weights all right we're gonna take those arms those hands together we're gonna bring them up all right we're gonna lower them down slowly breathe out and we're gonna take them behind our back and interlock those hands together all right we're gonna just hold it right here a little stretch in that chest opening up that chest hold it just here for three two one all right we're gonna just hinge that upper body forward just a bit and just hold it right here for three two one all right we're gonna release those hands bring them forward and just let them hang roll them out if you want a bit for three two one all right we're gonna slowly come up give me two shoulder rolls and back one two and you're gonna give me two forward one and two good work all right let's pick up those dumbbells again all right so we're gonna focus on our a bit of on our upper body and a bit on that core so what you're doing a little bend in those knees back straight chest proud i want you to come up with that dumbbell and then switch it over and come with the right so it should look just like this a little bend in those knees all right you're going to come up and then up and they're going to face they're going to hit right in the middle come back down bring it up and bring it up all right keeping that core tight at all times we're ready let's go bring it up and up there you go perfect let's go again up and up there you go these are called hooks body shots up and up there you go let's go for again left and right you got it keep it going left and right there you go again one and two again one and two there you go we got 10 seconds here bring it up and up there you go left right good keep it going left and right last one left and right good great work all right drop those weights amazing job all right oh i'm sweaty we're gonna bring those hands up lengthen take a deep breath in and a deep breath out again bring it up and down one last time bring it up and down all right guys grab a sip of water we're going to finish off with two to three exercises and then we're going to take a stretch and we're done for today all right Whew. all right 
everybody. So we're gonna just start off with just a bit of upper body movement with our own body weight. All right, so we're gonna just stand up. What we're doing, you're gonna hold your arms right here. We're gonna punch forward and bring it in. Punch forward, bring it in. All right, just your own body weight. Let's go. We're going left and right. Left, bring it in and right. Bring it in, there you go. Left, in, right, in. That's four, in, good, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good work. All right, now, can you give me just fast ones, little punches, fast little movements. I just want you, I don't want full extension on those arms. I want that core tight, back straight, and I really just want you to give me those small movements. All right, ready? Let's go. Small, there you go. Pump those arms, good. Good, there you go. Keep it going for five, four, three, two, one, and time. Great work, oh my God, amazing. All right, roll those shoulders. All right, we're gonna go again for that same thing. So I want you slow and steady on those, ex those full punches, controlled, and then I want those fast movements like we did before, all right? Let's go. Bring it forward and back, forward and back. There you go, perfect, that's two. Good, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good, give me five more. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. All right, ready? I'm gonna bring those back straight, chest proud. Keep that core tight, it's all in that core. All right, ready? Let's go. Fast movements. There you go, keep it going. Good, you got it, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one, and time. Amazing. Great work, all right. Woo. We got two more strength. So if you have your dumbbells, grab them. Two more exercises and then we're done for today. All right. So. All right, what we're doing. So we did these before. You're gonna just hold it up here in that shoulder press, a little bend in those knees. You're gonna close it in and then you're gonna open it up. You're gonna close it in and open it up, making sure that back is straight and that chest proud. All right, let's go for 10. So you're coming in, one, and out. Two, and out. Three, and out. There you go, perfect. Four, and out. Five, out. Six, out, seven, and out, eight, out, nine, out, and 10, and out. Go work, all right. Last exercise, just roll up those shoulders, shake it all out, all right. We're gonna come here, so you're gonna give me that V, all right, you're gonna bring it up, lengthen those arms straight, and then bring it back down into that V. 
Alrighty, we're good. Let's go. You're going to bring it up, lengthen those arms straight, and then you're going to bring it back down in that V. Perfect. Let's go. Two. And down. Three. And down. Four. And down. Five. And down. There you go. Six. And down. Seven. And down. Eight. Down. Nine. And down. Last one. Ten. And down. Good work, everybody. Amazing job. All right. Let's drop those weights. Let's take a nice long stretch. I'm sore. Whew. I'm sore. I'm sweaty. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We're going to come up. Bring those arms up. Reach for that sky and just hold it here just for a second. Deep breath in and deep breath out. Again, bring it in and bring it out. All right, if you can, bring yourselves on those tippy toes and just stretch that entire body, lengthen it and bring those arms down and then slowly start dropping back onto your heels. Good, perfect. Let's go again. You're gonna bring it up, reach for those tippy toes, balance, lengthen, and then slowly come back down on those heels. Good, perfect. One last time, let's go. Lengthen, up on those tippy toes, find that balance, and slowly come down on those heels. Good, great work. All right, you're gonna bring those hands in back, interlock them, and open up that chest, and just hold it here just for a second. For three, two, one, let's take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. One more time, bring it in and bring it out and slowly start letting go. Good. You're going to bring those arms forward. We're going to reach down just a little bit, bending those knees and you're going to just hold it right here just for a second and you're going to just sway those arms left to right for three, two, one, and time. We're gonna slowly roll up. All right, you're gonna bring those arms to the side. Lengthen, you're gonna reach left and reach right. Reach left, as you reach, give a little bend in that left leg, and then reach and give a little bend to that right leg. Good. Perfect. Keep it going. And left. Good. And then left again. Good job. We got two more. Right. And left. Good. All right. You're going to drop those arms. You're going to give me three shoulder rolls and back. So big rolls. One. Whew, two. And three. All right, bring them forward again. Same thing, bring it forward. One, two, and three. All right, you're gonna give me one big roll. And again, deep breath in, deep breath out. One last time, bring it in. And out. All right, let's bring that arm across that chest. Hold it right here. Whew, this feels nice. And we're gonna bring it in back. Keep that chin up and just hold it here for three, two, one, and release. We're gonna go the same thing, other arm. You're gonna bring it across, hold it to your chest. All right, bring it in back. Chin always stays up. Look forward. 
for three, two, one. All right, slowly release those hands. You're gonna give me three nice deep breaths. One. Again. Two. Last one. Three. Great work, everybody. Amazing job. I hope you enjoyed it. Whew. Great work. How are y'all feeling? A little sore? Great work, everyone. Um, so does anybody have any questions for Juliana? Oh, just thank you. <laughs> thank you. You're very you. good. Thank you. Thank you so much. Great work today, everybody. Thank you. Thanks a lot. No problem. <laughs> thank have you very much. I enjoy it every time. Thank you. Have a great Which, afternoon. Enjoy. We have, a, we have a quick question here. We just have oh. somebody who wants to know how much the dumbbells weigh. The ones I use? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> so today I only use two because <laughs> I did a class this morning that was upper body and core. So <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a little sore. So today I use two. But usually I use, yeah, three's perfect. Usually I use threes or fives. Mm. Okay. I wouldn't go, I wouldn't go more than, I mean, it depends on your strength, but um, between two and fives are good. If you want, you can go a little higher, but um, <laughs> I think that's a good amount. But like yeah. I, today I use two just because I'm, feel, I'm feeling it already. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So are there any other questions for Juliana? Hey, thank you, everyone. No problem. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank so Juliana, the, uh, the NCSA Education Committee would like to thank you for doing this fitness event and everybody who signed in today. Um, our next fitness event with Juliana is going to be next Thursday, the 27th. So if you haven't registered, we've put the link to our event break page. You can go on over and register and check out our upcoming uh, Brainy Boomer events uh, that are coming in September. And um, we've also put the link to a brief survey in the chat box. You guys could just let us know your thoughts about today's event or any other event you've uh, attended in the Brainy Boomer Lecture Series. Um, and we also want to let you know we have some exciting news. We've started a YouTube page. So you guys will be able to not only see this uh, event, but any other exercise event or any other Brainy Boomer Lecture event. So yeah, you guys, the link is in the description box and you guys can check it out and click the link and check out our other videos. So great right. work today and I hope to see you guys next week. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you guys. Have a great weekend. Enjoy. You too. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye. Bye. bye.